So is the flow going into the rundown tank? Okay. This area of study is called process technology in this department. And we're actually dedicated to the purpose of training personnel uh, to actually become plant operators. Plant operators themselves will find jobs in the workforce, uh, specifically pertaining to the oil and gas refiners, chemical plants, wastewater treatment units. Uh, we look at the food and beverage industry, the paper industry, and pharmaceuticals. But the skill level that they, they actually achieve in this area is tremendous. They actually get an opportunity to, to start out in the field where they work with the equipment. Equipment may be pumps, valves, it may be uh, tanks, uh, controllers. They get to understand the units and the thrilling part about all of this is that they take their skills in terms of communications. They actually communicate with the maintenance personnel, they communicate with the engineers and administration. One of the things about this program that actually is thrilling is that we have an aging workforce that will be retiring really soon. You find that our personnel, in terms of our students that we put through the program, they are finding jobs. Uh, they're being successful in terms of being placed in these jobs. Starting salary typically will range from about four to 5000 up to about $50,000, $55,000. Someone who's been in the field for about five years can easily get up to seven dollars to $80,000. It's a very exciting time, really. We make a deliberate effort to actually take the theory and marry that with the hands-on uh, training that we give to our students. Behind me, you see a simulator unit in terms of a distillation column. This is a unit that our students, on a routine basis, will start up uh, uh, start up from what we call a dead state and bring it to a live state, very similar to what you'll see in industry. Some of the companies that we have that come to us on a regular basis, Shell comes to us twice per year, once per semester. Uh, ExxonMobil will issue a recruitment once a year, BP is twice a year, and, and, and many other companies that come to us in terms of looking for our students. two career pathways that are available in the process technology department. There's a certificate program that is about approximately one year or about three semesters and then there's the associate degree which is two years. You find that a lot of the companies tend to emphasize that students be on the two-year career pathway. I like this program because there's plenty of opportunities out here in Houston, plenty of jobs available for everybody in this program. The teachers here come out of the field, so they're very knowledgeable on showing you what you can do once you get into the field. We do a lot of hands-on learning. As some of the other colleges, they don't do that, and I feel like I've really learned a lot, and I'm just ready to further on my career.